But in our next story, beneficiaries of the Livelihood Empowerment Against Poverty leap across the country have not received their allowances for the past six months. Though the ministry earlier said they had been working to mobilize funds, the beneficiaries are yet to receive anything this year. The Chief Accountant of Social Protection at the Ministry of Gender, Children and Social Protection, Ibrahim Yaya, says the outfit has since the end of last year not been able to raise funds to pay the beneficiaries. The Chief Accountant of Social Protection at the Ministry of Gender, Children and Social Protection, Ibrahim Yahya, who spoke on behalf of the Chief Director, Dr. Hafisa Zakaria, at the sidelines of a three-day training for the reassessment team of the LEAP program, organized for 10 districts within the northern part of Ghana, said. The LEAP is paid by monthly and six cycles in a year. But since the end of last year, they are yet to receive payment. Yeah. As you all know the situation right now, for, since January to now, we are supposed to pay six cycles in a year. We pay bi monthly every two months, we pay. But since January to June last month, we've not been able to raise money to pay them. So we are owing three cycles. Okay. The chief accountant said the ministry is not relenting in its efforts in finding resources to take care of the areas. But uh, we, are also, we are not sleeping. We are also working around, trying to engage government and other donors. Mr. Ibrahim said the ministry is considering an increment in the LEAP allowance. The increment in the household uh, benefits. It's usually guided by uh, our plan. And sometimes we take into consideration, we know for some, the last time we had an increment was 2015. And looking at the inflationary uh, how CD or purchasing power has uh, gone down, it is something we are considering too. But what happens is we normally do this with the Ministry of Finance. Sometimes we make proposals justifying why the uh, household's uh, allowance or benefits should be increased. And based on our justification and the circumstances prevailing, we are given the uh, opportunity to increase this uh, allowance. So, it is something we have been thinking about all along, especially now that the purchasing power, now 64 CD or 34, is 32, 34 CDs or 32 CDs a month for one single household. So you can just imagine what 32 CDs will buy right now. It's very, very insignificant, but we have to follow the due process, engage the stakeholders, then they buy in and understand our situation before this uh, increment coming. Okay. But we have that in mind. Okay.